why you should watch Oppenheimer in IMAX 70mm film. This is a 4 perf 35mm film. And this is 70mm non-IMAX film. It has 5 perfs, which means it's a little bit taller than 35mm film, but a whole perf. And it's two times wider. Why this film came into existence, we're gonna talk in another video. But today we're here to talk about something else. So 70mm film has a lot more data, a lot more resolution than 35mm film. And 35 millimeter film has a lot more resolution in data than 16 millimeter film, which has a lot more resolution in data than 8 millimeter film. Well, with this one, you can barely see what's what's on it. With 16 millimeter, you can kind of see, but it's still not the best. 35 millimeter film was a good standard of good resolution, good movies, and then 70 millimeter film came into existence, which introduced us to the widescreen. But there's something else, something that has a lot more data, something that has a lot more resolution to it, something so great that you're gonna be blown away by the picture quality. Meet 70 millimeter IMAX film. The main difference is obviously the size. So 70 millimeter non-IMAX film has only five perfs. 70 millimeter IMAX film has 15 perfs. You can count them, pause the video. Which means that 70 millimeter IMAX film is three of non-IMAX 70 millimeter film stacked together and ran horizontally. This is IMAX film cell of the film Interstellar. And on the macro shot here, you can see how much detail, how much resolution this one film cell is holding. It's insane, it's just, it's mind-blowing. And if you go back and compare it to 35 millimeter film, you can see, even on the macro shot, that if we zoom in to the same close shot with IMAX 70 millimeter film and 35 millimeter film, that the difference in resolution is huge. So besides Nolan being director of the film, Cillian Murphy playing Oppenheimer, and the fact that Nolan said there's no use of CGI, I don't think you need any more reasons to go and watch it. But what you should watch it on is IMAX 70 millimeter 15 perf film. Thanks for watching. Hit the like if you like this video. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to get all the notifications about new upcoming videos. We have a lot in store for you and I'll see you in the next one. New studio, video number one, scene one, take two.